Okay, welcome back everybody. Today I am racing at the Lion Scout held by the playground. So this is the place you can see. It's held at the Begonia Pavilion at downtown East. Look at the crowd guys. Look at the crowd. We want this back into our scene if possible. Right guys. So today uh, the format will be uh, raced on a five lane tracks. Uh, wooden. So the playground is the first one to have a wooden track uh, set up in Singapore. So if you happen to go by Singapore, come by to the playground and check it out. And uh, the race format on round one is uh, five take three. Uh, but you must complete the lap. So five take three. And then right now we are in round two. So we're going to take a little bit of uh, some uh, B-rolls. Uh, we record it. Uh, then catch you in my situation. Oh, by the way, I got four slots in the first round, so push me luck. Eh? Bye bye. <laughs> We're going to go over the track layout right now. So we start off with here. Okay, this is the starting point. We have a series of straights, then you go with a short jump, and then you go straight, and then a series of corners, and then to a bank, and then a flat jump, and then the corner, and then there's a short jump but down, and then you come back here, turn and a series of corners, and the last bank with a digital AB. And then back to the starting point. You can see the riding on the pavement. Don't kick the growing up in basement. Online, a whole new generation. I'ma make fun, so you better go take it. Always they need a new replacement. Decentralized, can't contain it. We're changing lives, yeah, upgrading. Call it to a side of the older generation. Yeah, today I want to talk to somebody. Yeah, he say go fishing. Ah, why he come to race? Hello. Ah, <laughs> huh? he say you want to go fishing. Don't disturb me. I ask you. Ah, this one. Hello, excuse me, birthday boy. Ah, huh? this one birthday boy. Ah, na. Later, ah. Okay, ah, gula, ah, gula, ah. Okay, apart from mini four wheel drive at this place, uh, the Begonia Pavilion near downtown East, we have some RC action drift, RC drifting action here going on. Uh, take a look. So, you see how how they are drifting around. Quite interesting. But if I'm going to pick up this hobby, that's it, man. My bank is going to burn. Uh, rather not start me one. Me for enough. Uh, maybe when my kid grow up, who knows? I try something else. But I'm more interested in off road. Let's see how. Or rather, Mini Z. Oh, yeah, Mini Z is something is uh, similar to Mini 4 in terms of skill and also have uh, this kind of drifts. Uh. Okay, so I'm not sure if they are running on competition or it's a, uh, a hobby group or anything, but looks fun. Uh. It's a healthy community down here. Yeah. Bye -bye. Okay. Hello, people. So this race, uh, explain a bit. Why, why, uh, what race will make this race? Uh, uh, Ian, uh, I don't know how to trade with everything. Okay. So right now we are at uh, downtown east. So this race is uh, called Lion Cup. 
So whoever win, right, you get uh, 500, 400, this big 500, 300, 400. Okay, like some big price, okay? Some, some big price. Okay. Plus Johor Cup ticket. Uh. Uh, Where's the Johor Cup? Uh, Johor Cup. Uh. Uh, at the start of November. So where, where I fly to Japan already. That's why I can't One month's time from now. Yes. Okay, but I'm probably not going, uh, but it's okay. <laughs> So oh, you enjoy the race, right? Eh, hey, good race. Who who uh, come up with this layout? Ah, uh, Jujuri, ju 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 right? J what? Jari, right? Johari. Oh. Ah, uh, Din. Zainu Din. Ah, oh, yes. sorry. Okay. Pronounce your <laughs> name. But they use the same layout for the Joho Cup also. Or? Yes, exactly. Exactly. Yes. So before that, right, they got a pre Joho Cup, which uh, I already play. They got a flight army below there, uh, wow, very dangerous. Then now become a straight, more forgiving this time. Oh, yes. So, 95% uh, same? Yeah, uh, 100%. Oh, this okay. is final already. Oh, okay. Mm. okay. So, what you play here is gonna be the actual Joho Cup. Okay, so good luck to whoever wins today. Yes. And then, and then uh, hopefully, we can get. Uh, hopefully, you, you three win. Uh. I, then I, can, I, I, I'm, I'm not going, so that's yeah, yeah, get the price money that you sell. All <laughs> <laughs> right, we'll see you in the action later. Okay, bye bye. bye. Okay, guys, time check is 6 p.m. and uh, the race is still going on. But however, my luck. I only have one, one slot. I only have one slot. And I'm currently racing with this VZ chassis. Uh, my MS sucked, so I decided to run my VZ, which apparently did not suck as bad. But I don't know. My chance, my conversion rate, like, I would say, is around 20% only, so not very high, but uh, I don't know. If you really like the shiny, catch you soon later. Uh, time check now already now 7 p.m. We are coming nearing the end of the event and uh, these are the few number of slots. How many total? How many total now? 90 something. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. 18 and a half, 18 and a half times 5. 90, 90 races, around 90, 90 races. About 90 plus races. So, these are, these are all the races that will run in the next round. How many? Three, 5 take 2. 5 take 2. Then the last two, uh, 4 take 2. Ah, last two, 4 take 2. Okay. Well. So, that's going to be the next round. And then uh, from 90 plus, cut down another uh, 40%. Means you get about another 20 over races. And you will hit the support semi final already. Yo! So long ever to you. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, let's start. Check it out. Later, bye bye. So, after all that racing today, my physic decided to break during a crucial run. Run to get top. Uh, not say top lah maybe the last uh, 50 races or something races uh, so race to top 10 i guess uh and as you can see my slam just broke so we're gonna talk about this a bit uh and what's the possibility because I couldn't detect this fault before it happened. I mean, this is not a preventable fault uh, per se. Uh, it's not something that I 
probably could catch on pretty on in the race but it's a bit uh, unfortunate that it broke so I'm just going to talk briefly about this and what's my mitigation plan for this also uh, basically the screw that attached to the slam the body damper system broke and it broke cleanly off at the lock nut here so as you can see it's a clean break so it, this tells me that this particular screw is not really strong or flexible enough to withstand that uh, uh what do you call that the pressure or the impact uh, it's the word impact so i upon close inspection it seems that i'm using the black countersunk screws for this guy so maybe lesson learned don't use black countersunk screw uh, i find that black countersunk screws they look nice but they don't last forever at least they don't last as long as the silver countersunk screw at least so i guess that's the end for today's race maybe uh, hopefully i got better luck on the next one so catch you guys soon in the next one ciao keep on running and don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel for more content like this bye bye